we're in an alleyway in the Holy Land and as you can see behind me there are bins overflowing and there's litter across the whole length of the alleyway um, and this is an all year round issue but particularly bad in the summer months. We get reports from students that landlords have told them that they need to empty the properties um, to get their deposits back so you end up with um, fly tipping, you end up with dumping in all of the alleyways but then you have the issues of beds being delivered or being um, dumped, bulk items like fridges and this is not, these are not items that are being dumped by students. These are items that are being dumped by people who are replenishing those items in those, in those properties. Um, but it just becomes, it becomes an eyesore, but it also becomes a very real health issue. Um, we see rats all over the place here. Um, council workers having to wade through rubbish to unblock alleyways. There becomes a real fire risk um, when alleyways get blocked, um, access to properties gets blocked and we end up with quite a lot of um, fires in your bins in this area. You couldn't really run the same um, waste management program as you do in other parts of Belfast. This is because there are so many properties in this area. So you're talking maybe a, a house that was historically a four bedroom house that is now um, three flats that house maybe three or four people in each flat. The sheer amount of black bins that that would, uh, that would accumulate, that would need, um, we know from other places that would end up on the, at the end of alleyways, causing other issues um, with waste management as well. So it's quite difficult to come up with a, a bin emptying plan for this area. Um, and this is what the, the council have put in instead, is these euro bins um, to be used for all the properties um, in the street. It's quite good that people are getting annoyed about the city centre and the state of the city centre at the minute. Um, we want that anger to stretch up to areas like the Holy Land and Stramalus because this is an area that has been left like this for decades. This is not a new issue here. Um, as I said, it's gone on year on year. Um, there is a lack of recycling, um, if any recycling is done at all. Um, and it's just not sustainable for our city.